Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you how shell sort works. So for this example, we're going to use what's known as a Hebert sequence, 1, 3, 7, 15, which is uh, 2 times the previous value plus 1. And okay, so the first thing has to be done is to find a gap that actually can be used for this list. So this list has only seven items, so let's um, make our maximum gap as three. In this case, we actually have to sort all the keys that has a window distance of three. So in this case, let's start with three, four, and one. And we want to make sure if these three items, items are sorted in ascending order using insertion sort. So the first thing is you try to compare the 4 and 1. And when you do that, you have to do the swap. And compare 3 and 1. And again, you do the swap. So now all the thing, all keys in this particular window um, gap is are sorted in ascending order. So you will move on. Now you, you compare 2 and 6, they're already sorted. 5 and 7, they're already good. And now you're done. Okay, so the next sequence gap we find is 1. And if you are using k is equal to 1, it's just like a regular insertion sort. So let's start with 2. And you compare 2 and 1, it's already in order, so you move on. 2 and 5, move on. And 3 now is not in order, so you have to swap with 5. So 3 and 5 are swapped. And now everything is in order, so you move on. 6 and 5, you're good. 7, 6, you're good. 4 and 7, now 7 is greater, so you do the swap. Again, 6 is greater than 4, so you do the swap again. 5 again. So And now everything is in order, so you stop. So once you are done with all these sequences, um, then you have a list with um, sorted values in ascending order.